We've got one, two, three, four boxes. Four boxes tonight and one envelope. Vera, Vera jumped. Oh. Yeah, I hear some of you guys, yeah, are going to get some, get some snow. Oops, wait, I went too, or I went too fast. I went too slow. Let me, hang on. what was that? The, I, <laughs> I heard about, I heard about that in you see. Lily was in the, in the basket over there. She told me that she thought it was uh, magenta in there first. <laughs> Yeah, I had to laugh. And I didn't even have to do that one. <laughs> oh, okay. Billy Six, you're the first one to offer, so you wanna wanna do it to it? Aw, whoops, well, fear is eating at the moment, then I will. Well, let's open herself. And the story about Fabio, um, well, let me do that right now. What's, what, you mean the story about how Fabio got to be here? Is that what you mean, Leggy? <laughs> yeah, he got inside. Well, yeah, he, that's what I heard. Um, you know, Fabio is not allowed in here because he does spray. And, uh, well, first off, I'll tell you a little bit about his past. When he first, somebody dropped him off here at the rescue center. And uh, this has been, gosh, what, five, six, six, seven years ago, maybe? I'm not sure. And uh, I remember the first time I saw him was over over by um, one of the food sheds outside and uh, I saw this cat and I thought oh my gosh how beautiful is he well he wouldn't let me anywhere near him and uh, it took me about two weeks before he decided that I was okay enough to uh, to be in his presence so he then let me pet him and then from that point on it was like you know now we can't keep him back <laughs> Um, but we used to let him here in. Well, actually, first, he used to stay, spend a lot of time in the clinic. And then he just thought he was too too big for his own britches. And he would spray right in front of us in the clinic. So I told everybody he could not be in the clinic. We can't have that in a clinic. So he, of course, then became one of our, our uh, sun porch kitties. And he sneaks in here all the time. And... You know, I've had to do a double take with Fabio, too, because he does look a lot like our Badu. And did you hear anything about that, Angie? Uh -uh. Well, Fabio got in here today, and um, Jackie S. and Ruth was here. Yeah. And they thought it was, the, the viewers kept telling them that Fabio was in here. And they kept saying, no, no, that's Badu. Uh -huh. And it turned out it was Fabio. <laughs> So they picked the the way that they could tell they decided was they would pick the cat up and if it scratched their faces off it would be Badu. This is what they said. And if it wasn't then it was Fabio. And then when they got the cat in the room they realized it was Fabio. So I laughed and laughed when they told me about it. But he's got so much fur on him. He's uh, Dr. Cindy is the one that actually named him, you know, the Fabio, the actor that tosses his head in this hair. Well that's how Fabio because his hair just ruffles around when he when he runs around so he's a pretty cool cat so that's Fabio and you know our some porch kitties just as an FYI they get um, they keep current on their vaccines they every few years I'll even run another FIV leukemia test on them they get monthly flea prevention and they get warm twice a year so we try to keep up with those guys too so we'll get started here um let's do let's do this one first so uh is a silly sticks that's going to be the the cavitary i believe i think i think is that yes sir
And he would know it too if he was missing one speck of that. <laughs> Can you see again? Yay! Okay, we'll get it. All right, we're back again. Are we leaving this cage open at all? Um, in the tomorrow morning, I'll leave it open again. Uh, he he had his door open earlier today. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna kind of sort of start over again. This is from I'll even pretend it's still shut. This is from Colleen C O L L E E N P, and Colleen lives in California, and. I was saying Colleen is helping us get ready for baby season because there's three little nook nooks, I call them nook nook bottles, and a can of the Just Born Highly Digestible Milk Replacer, the KMR. So thank you Colleen. You know normally we don't worry about babies yet because after all it's still February, although it's close to, Feb, to the end of well, it is the end of February. Um, but normally we don't expect babies to come in here till like the 1st of April in there. But I already know of some mommy cats that have already had their babies. Unbelievable. And my, you know, we've had an extremely easy winter this year. Very little snow and warm temperatures. Um... And my peacocks, who usually don't start strutting their stuff until um, until like late March, have already been doing their peacock thing for a couple of weeks now. And also today was the final proof I needed that we're going to have spring early. Um, my geese out there usually don't start laying their eggs until into uh, the end part of March. We got our first goose egg today. Wow. Never have seen one this early before. So, spring is a coming, people. Uh, okay, our second one is what's well, from. Um, Massachusetts. <laughs> you think I'd remember that one by now? And we have to look inside for a name because all I have is the last name. But the first name starts with a K. From Massachusetts. Ugh. Aww. Okay, we'll do this one first. Oh. <laughs> I'll show you. Oh, that cat here. Wow, I wonder where that came from. <laughs> this is, oh, this is from Kelly. So it's Kelly N. And from Massachusetts, and Kelly's cam name is Loon, L-O-O-N-2. It says, I'm a newbie to your site, and I love it. I tune in every day and feel like I'm part of the FFRC family. That's what we like to have you all feel like. I think everything you, you all do is just wonderful. I wish that I was closer. I would love to volunteer there. My first job was as a vet tech at, a, at an animal hospital and almost all of my animals were rescues or from our local shelter. I had a three-legged cat, Amelia, and her story reminds me so much of your sweet Bella. Amelia, Amelia was hit by a car and someone picked her up off the road and came into the hospital where I worked and left her on the receptionist counter. When we came out front, she was just lying on the counter. She had a severely broken back leg. At the time, the shoulder was full and could not take her or deal with her extensive injuries. My boss, one of the vets, said that we were going to put her down to end her suffering as she had no owner and no one that claimed her. I took care of her and every time I went near her cage, she dragged herself to the front looking for attention and she purred and headbutted me. Imagine that after all she had been through and the pain she must have been in. To make a long story short, I could not see her put down. She was so sweet and had such a will to live. One of the vets said she could have a good life with three legs, so we did surgery and amputated her leg, and after her recovery, I took her home with me. I had her for 14 years. I don't know. I don't think she ever got the memo that she had three legs. 
For her entire life, she was happy, active, and was one of the most loving, affectionate cats I ever had. She passed about five, six years ago, and I now have two boys that are rescues, Indy Gray and Cosmo, black and white. They are both sweet boys, and the photo of them is in my dog's bed while the dog is on the floor. I have enclosed some things for FFRC, and check this out. She's got these numbered. Aw, she's got these these numbered. Um, number one. Um, well, let me just let me just open them. Number one, cat toy that my boys love, and I hope all the kitties will like. Number two, a few different items for your catathon. Do whatever you wish for them with them. Put in a basket or by themselves. My sister and I started a business last year making jewelry with recycled game pieces. Scrabble, dominoes, poker chips. I hope you like them. Jackie, I numbered the boxes. Please read the description and then open. I saved my favorite for last. I hope you like them as much as I do. With love from two loans or two loons, jewelry and Kelly. Jewelry and Kelly, please give Bella a big hug and kiss for me. Oh, and here's her Amelia. Oh, she kind of looks like our buttons, doesn't she? Kind of looks like a buttons. And, oh, <laughs> yeah, this is Cosmo and Indy. Yeah, look at those two rascal cats in the dog bed while the dog is laying on the floor. Typical cats, huh? They know what to do. All right, so we got, so so Kelly has numbered these, so we'll start out with one. Always make sure I keep the rubber bands. So so her, her name of her business, the jewelry business, is called Two Loons Jewelry Company. Two Loons Jewelry Company. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at, oh it, oh. It oh, is, it, it, that's not a, a is it a domino or is it that other one? Look at this, the back of it is the domino, whoops, there we go, is the domino, and the front of it is, I, it's, it's a design in it with like an acrylic over it, that is really neat, thank you Kelly. That is just beautiful. Wow. I bet that's kind of fun doing doing something like that. That's pretty cool. Thank you, Kelly. It's made with Japanese paper. Oh, so Loon's on. Thank you. That's really cool. Okay, this is number two. And, it, and again, it says Two Loon's Jewelry Company. Oh, my gosh. Now, what now, loons? I know you're on there. What what is the back of this one now? It has a, that two on there, and then this side. Check that out. Isn't that isn't that beautiful? See that? Oh, that's pretty. I like the colors in that's that. Better. I know that's a game piece, but I'm not that's sure. Better. Oh, yeah, the ma 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 Mahjong tile. Yeah, that's what it is. Thanks, Han Jess. And Leggy Gal, thank you. Okay, okay, that's all right. You guys did, so thank you. Isn't that cool? Wow. Talent, talent. And this one says, this one is for you. Ooh, we need a drum roll. Oh, my God. Oh, yes. There you go. Oh, this. I have to make a whole bunch of those. I know it. This is awesome. Check this out. Our logo. 
and it's how our logos on there oh my gosh isn't that awesome thank you loon too I know it uh, isn't that awesome yep I mean it's just it's just perfect the at the edges on there is so so clean and crisp isn't that neat and it's got like an acrylic on the front of it that is really cool thank you loon too I will treasure that yeah that's pretty cool I have to show that to to my kids. I'm going to see a bunch of my family tomorrow, so I'll show that to them. I know if they don't get it. <laughs> I'm just going to wear it and say it's hooked on there forever. And number four, and she said this is her favorite. Although I think number three is the favorite. As oh my gosh! On a scrabble. Oh, isn't that neat? That's too cute. So this one is on a Scrabble piece. What a clever idea. Look at that. Oh, wait a minute. Let me get it where... There. Can you see it? There. Isn't that awesome? We we didn't cats own me. Um, uh... A webcam friend, B did. We had a contest. Gosh, what's this been? A year ago or so? That we had that that contest. And uh, yeah, a lot of people submitted different suggestions for for the logo. And B B is the one who won it. And we put it on on um, of course our our new um, oh business cards. And our stationery and some t-shirts we've just used it for lots of things Loon 2 thank you for these these are awesome awesome pieces of jewelry I'm going to put the rubber bands on he does like to be held and he needs holding thank you Loon 2 these are really cool I love the idea that you did that you did it on um, like game tiles. Really cool. Wow. And and some kitty toys for the kittens. They're they're funny farms black eyed peas. <laughs> Do you guys want these tonight? Oh, and they do rattle. So, two rattle toys for the kitties. Yeah, you want that? Says maybe. Maybe. There you go, kittens. You want that one? You better get that. So, thank you, Kelly. I appreciate that very much. Kelly. And, wow. We, that's pretty cool. Isn't that amazing, the variety of stuff that comes in? Just really amazing. Okay, and this one is M. Last name starts with S, but we'll look inside and see where it's from. Oh, this is from out of the country. So let's see. Oh, boy. Ooh, okay. Let's start with this. This is from Martha S. Martha S. And, oh, let me see if I can figure out where this is from. Oh, dear. It's, it's on the bottom line. It's APO, then, then a space, and AP. I'm not sure where that is from. Maybe somebody out there can help me with that. And this says, um, I really enjoyed watching Friends of Felines on Ustream. I feel like I have gotten to know the volunteers and cats there. It is fun. Aha, here we go. I live in Okinawa, Japan. I teach PA at middle school, 
Rebecca, boy, I really botch up the language. <laughs> Raya, okay, I, I uh, teach PE at middle school, which is located <clears throat> on Candida Air Force Base. I love everything about Okinawa except for the treatment of animals. I, too, rescue cats. I am enclosing some cards I have made. Painting is one of my hobbies, and I think that Friends of Felines would be my audience. Many of the cats are my own or friends, which makes it that much more fun to paint. I also have an art website on Facebook called Massa, M-A-S-A. Again, thanks for everything you do. Cheers, Martha S. You know, my one daughter, um, Christy, she lived in Okinawa when she, she and her husband was there. He was in the service there. She loved it, loved it there. Oh, she's got her business cards in here. Isn't that cute? That's a cute business card. And, oh, and you even included envelopes. How nice of you. So you painted these. Oh, look at the next one. Oh my gosh. Pastel Olive. This is awesome. Fluffy Cat. The next one's quilty. Oh. oh. Big Boy, spelled B O I. Oh my gosh, that's awesome, too. June Bug. Aw, Kate would like Aww. that. June, she always called her Kate June Bug. Oh, this one, I don't know what. I don't know my glasses. She doesn't have her glasses on. <laughs> well, good thing I know it's on the list most days. Oh, Cammy, like C A M M I. Cute. I like Isn't that. that? These are really awesome. Oh, look at that one. You know, I love writing thank you notes. And I just sent out a whole bunch of them today. I, it's in Japan, the name on the back, so I'll, I can't pronounce it. I know, isn't that style awesome? This is, oh, this is bigger than life. Gosh, these are really, really cute. Like oh, one. look at that. I love the colors. Orange cat. I like that. That, that is pretty. Oh, oh, martini olive. This is no, your favorite. That no. <gasps> that this one is the same olive that's on the on that first one that we looked at. Meet Jack. Yeah, no, that's that's really cool. Very very talented. Oh, look at the colors in this rainbow cat. Oh, good. Oh, and another one. It's uh, got another Japan name on there, Japanese name at, but it also says at Angkor Wat. Yeah, so her name is Martha S. There is a webcam I want one of those site. Or one of her, business cards. her business cards. There you go. I'll give you her her website. I saw somebody ask for it. It's Martha. S-T-A-N-T-O-N, -T -T so Martha Stanton at gmail.com. Martha Stanton at gmail.com. Usually I don't do last names, but since she provided the card, uh, that is what her, her, uh, there you go, you get it right there. Martha Stanton at gmail.com. It's pretty There you go. Thanks, Bantry. Would you relax now? Yeah. It's getting heavy. <laughs> it's an instant joy. Wow. Thank you. See, I just said, look at the variety of things that we get. Okay. This one is from Robert T. from Michigan. Next door neighbor state. Robert T. from Michigan. Yep, did you get the website for for Martha? Is 
So this one is from Robert T. from Michigan. Please press firmly. Ah, there we go. Ooh, this looks like fun. No letter. Robert Hughes. I've never seen something like this before. Oh, oh, this would be ideal for our little girl. Check this out. It says eases separation anxiety. Your snuggle kitty. I warm up. I have a real feel heartbeat. You know the heaters that we have, like right here in with um, Angel Kisses has a snuggle warmer in it. It's got to be of the same of the same thing. So Robert T from Michigan. Oh. I have never there's two of them in here. There's two. Oh look at this. So we warm these up and you know we have lots of heat things. Heat packs, soul satisfying products, 24 hours. All you have to do is shake these. You don't microwave them. All you do is like those um, warmers that we use out on the farmyard. Place pouch inside the under stuffed animal pocket. Allow 15 to 30 minutes for the heater or for the warmer to heat up. The heater is finished heating when the contents become hard and solid. Dispose a pouch with regular trash. And look. Oh, we have to use scissors, it says. And of course I always read directions, you know. Oh. <laughs> I've been here around long enough to know better than that. <laughs> Not calling you a liar. <laughs> but there we go. These are close enough to scissors. Uh, let's see. Oh, isn't this cute? And then so that can go in there. But check this out. Whoops, what do I have there? Oh, that's the snuggle Peter thing. Oh. Feel it, yeah. Isn't that cool? So I pulled the tag out of the heart, and well, I was going to say, here, feel it. <laughs> This is really awesome. It feels it. It does that, that 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 the dub for the heart. Oh, Cape Cod senses. Oh, this is Cape Cod. Oh, I should have known that because I think I have an email. Thank you, Cape Cod. This is just awesome. We're gonna we're gonna do this right away for our little girl. Okay, so we get these out. Can you imagine these little um, baby babies that we get with no mama? What they'll think of this? Okay, so we're going to leave this out for just a minute. And then we'll slip it in here, slip it in there along with heartbeat. And you can you can turn this off. And um, there's two batteries in there that we can replace it. So pretty cool. Cape Cod Cat, thank you. This is really, really cool. See, you guys are all in tune for baby season. Okay, we're going to leave that warm up. And, gosh, well, can I have that belt about a girl? 
Oh. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at this. So this one's for a yellow tiger. And then there's a whole batch. Oh, and more batteries, too. Keep God, thank you. This is awesome. So there's extra batteries. There's the extra of the heat packs. And uh, I'm going to put this one in June's room. Check that out. Isn't that awesome? You know, we've also have gotten these. Well, these are the backups. I've got other ones in there that's already off of the, that we've already used a lot. Um, we've gotten these too that we've gotten from new web cameras. These are the last two, I believe, that we haven't used. Because after a while, they, the insides do get a little icky. But these are warm, microwavable too. And we've used these. You just pop them in the microwave. I think these have buck, buckwheat in them. And they warm up. Yeah, these are really nice too. Huh. Isn't that cool? Thank you, Cape Cod. That's pretty cool. Okay, you can see there. Excuse me, promise. Wow. Okay, this one is from Bandit. And Bandit is a bird. Uh, is a parrot. Um, says, my name is Bandit and I am a Senegal. I'm not sure if I pronounced that right. Parrot. And I am 28 years old. I live in Florida. My mom watches your mom's webcam every night. So this is for er Einstein. And sometimes I can watch with her if I'm good. I feel sorry for you having to keep an eye on all those fur balls all day long. You even had to learn their language. I hear you meowing. I hope they don't bother you too much. I should get Einstein out here, but I already kept him in bed. We can't have dogs or cats in our home because my daddy is allergic to them. So mom watches the cam every night and dreams of having kitties someday. My mom says she would be willing to trade daddy in whoops, <laughs> in exchange for some kitties. If your mom, Jackie, would be interested in a slightly used husband to work around the rescue center, mom says he doesn't eat much and isn't much help with anything around the house. But at least he can make people laugh with all his jokes. But my dad is my best friend. Even though I've been with mom for 28 years, I like dad the best. That makes mom mad sometimes because she's the one who cleans my cage, buys all my food and toys. Hi, Jenny. Just Jenny. Sometimes when I am bad, my mom will tell me that I'm old enough to go out and get a job to pay for all the bird seed she spends on me. I just laugh. And yes, I've learned to laugh from television. I can also speak about 25 people words, and I am, am even poop trained. Oh, I wish Einstein was, which my mom appreciates when I'm riding on her shoulder. Now, one thing, Einstein is never poopied on anybody. He Once in a while, he'll... Some will get on the floor, but not very often. We used to have a pet rabbit in our house, and I would intentionally drop my food down to the floor from the top of my cage and watch him come over and eat it. That was fun. My mom also raised gold, goldian finches for a while, and I had some fun whistling and tripping with them during the day. But they have gone to forever homes now, too. So, Liney, since all birds must flock together, I am sending you a care package, too. I don't want you to feel left out of your own home with all those kitties roaming around. As we both know, parrots rule the roost, don't we? Well, at least we think we do. Please tell Mama Jackie thank you from me and my mom for taking such good care of all the fur balls and finding them forever homes. Next time you're in front of the cam, I need, please give me and all the other avian cam watchers a shout out. Your friends, Bandit and Mama Patty, and they're from Florida. So this is from from Bandit and uh, Mama Patty. And in case you want to know, that was our wonderful tweenie that was up there by the camp. So Einstein got his very first letter. Yeah, that was it was uh it was uh tweenie. She's getting that that fish toy. 
And if our cat Terry on there could also put for Patty, Mama Patty, that she donated a, a check or a don made a donation to the rescue center. Aww. I see what. Oh, here's a picture of her bird. Of 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 Bandit. Oops, let's see what else we got. <laughs> oh, I've seen those. It says, help me, Sheriff Putter, arrest my dad so I can watch more Animal Planet. Uh, is he chewing that? Is he chewing that sock up or the shoe up? And then here's another picture of him. He's very handsome. I bet you Einstein would like him. This says, Playtime with Dad in the morning. He is beautiful. He looks like he's a real smart bird. What? I have to figure out which way. Oh, here we go. Look at that. It says, um, Bandit. Trying to pull out dad's business cards out of his pocket. Isn't that cute? I bet he's fine. Yes, that's right, Sarah. And last but not least, a close up of Bandit says, Where's dinner? I'm hungry. That's almost like he's right there on you. Isn't that cute? Thank you. I love it when you guys share share the pictures. Thank you, Patty, and thank you, Bandit. Ooh. <laughs> that a Detroit one? Yes. <laughs> and this is what Einstein got. He got peanut treats. In the park already? Pull and shell. Oh, there's something else. Oh, yeah. I think somebody got a bit cat. Little treaties. This is just an Einstein uh, packet. Yeah. Yeah. And the Extreme Santa Fe Parrot Treat. I got him one of these a long time ago and he liked it. And he loves these. These are the Nutra Berries. Boy, Bandit, you're a nice bird to share with Einstein. <laughs> and these, he likes these too. These are one of the toys that Einstein likes. He'll pick off all the bark. He'll ring the bell till he drives me crazy. We can we put these sometimes on the out. He's got toys on the inside and outside of his pen. Yeah, Einstein does does the thing tonight, and he'll love that. Is that funny? Yeah, he'll love that that uh, ball there too. Yeah, him and his beak. Just like Bandit, I'm sure. Busy, busy beat boy. Thank you. Thank you, Bandit. That's really nice. Einstein really, really made out. Isn't that pretty? I love it. I know. It's beautiful necklaces. And Jenny, check, check this out. It's a stuffed. It's for baby, baby, kitty. These stay warm for 24 hours. Oh, you shake it. Uh huh. And then you stick it in here. It's it's all nice and warm now. And it goes in here. So like angel kisses in there. Oh. But check this out. Oh my God! That's like so a heartbeat. Cool. That is cool. And that's what's shrunk rat in here. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, it looks like a shrunk rat. Shrunk, shrunk rat, rat cat. <laughs> yeah, Einstein says my name like in 20 different ways because he hears the volunteers or people say it. Okay. He's got his heat pack. That is really awesome. Feel that too there. Oh my gosh, it's got warm and cool too, but it's not too warm. Can you hear it? Feel it though? Yeah. Uh huh. That's really cool. That's cool. cool. Okay, you got a mommy coming in there to make you feel better. Check this out, baby. Okay. Come on, I 
Off to go. Off to go. Where's your Yeah, where do you think? <clears throat> Thank you, everybody. That was pretty cool. That was really cool. Um, we got another one here, too. For another heat pack. Um, so, I don't have a lot of updates. Other than we've been holding uh, angel kisses a lot today, <clears throat> and uh, also Rory a lot, and uh, they both are coming along. Rory, you know, was a outside kitty, and uh, when you first approach him, he's a little bit like, oh my goodness, what's going to happen? But then once you got him, he's a little bum. He's just a a cuddle bum, and then also. Uh, Angel Kisses, she's very interested in everything that's going on. O'Malley did go back to his real home, uh, and he's got his neuter appointment this week. For sure, we'll be going in to get that. So they were very happy to have him back, and O'Malley was very happy to see his family. That was very, very, very sweet for me to see. Uh, um, she's just now laying beside it. Actually, she she was over a little bit further, and now she's laying beside it a little more. Her breathing is just a little bit accelerated, but she has a little bit of rattles. Um, but it's not bad. It's better, I think, now than what it was this morning. Yep, we'll show you all around. I missed a question of something about Bandita. Oh, my. I don't remember what month that was Bandita was adopted, but it's been... Probably at least seven, eight months ago. Hi, Stinky Peep. Um, when I worked at the vet's office, we always told everybody it's always a good idea to bring in a stool sample once a year. And like my kitty's inside, I do just in case somehow, somewhere, one, you know, there was a worm. And because all it takes is like if one has a residual roundworm or something, then the next cat going in the box can also get it. Or if you don't like giving the medicines without a just cause, then take in a stool sample. But, you know, normally once you actually clear them out all the way, they usually don't pick up the roundworms, hookworms, or the whipworms. And cat stock is the 15th. Twinks. Twinks is uh, struggling a little bit today. Her appetite was not very good yesterday and not good this morning. Then Jody, our volunteer, walks in this morning. She had a little bit of leftover uh, egg and cheese thing and just was going to give it to anybody. There was Twinkle. She gave it to Twinks and she gobbled it up. So I went in, cooked her a couple eggs with cheese in it. She ate like three meals, two, three meals of it. Really good. And then she didn't want any more, but we're, we'll save it for her. She ate treats tonight. But and she, food. okay, so she did. There's our twinkles. Yes, I heard Patty pee-peed pee -peed on the steps. So the steps are not out tonight because it's in the tub. I gave it a good scrub job. Where was Badu found earlier? Uh, I'm not sure what you mean. I know I don't think Badu was missing. You mean earlier today? Was he, I didn't know he was. she was missing. She's out in the office right now. Oh, she's out in the office for right now. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I didn't know that she was missing. They didn't tell me that. But she's here. Sarah has had her medicine. <laughs> Sherry's awesome with the kitty. <laughs> I know, some days Twinks eats really good. <laughs> Happy birthday! It's not my birthday. My mama's, my mom's birthday is tomorrow, and I can't wait to take all her cards out. And coming up. No, no, yeah. no, no. <laughs>
They already know when your birthday no. is. No, yes, I have they do. Yeah, Twinkles has lost a little bit of weight. Yes, I have. I have tried the a track cat a track litter. <laughs> Are you quite happy, Kira? She's the one making the noise on the fish. She's making biscuits. And I know a lot of people that we've recommended it to that has had success with that. The Cat Attract. Um, Pet Supply Plus sells it. Pet Smart sells it. <laughs> Lini, I did not. If you're talking about like another picture for the front of the book. The cookbook, I did That's not get I'm that. That's why I'm here tonight to take some more of the permanent. Okay, mm -hmm. I didn't get that. And you guys can do what you want with the front. Yeah, you guys got free reign. I've tried tuna with her. Patty, Patty uh, Cake has decided to be Patty Kerr again, I guess, last night. He was a bad boy. But he's very sorry. We <laughs> we use uh, Odoban a lot. I love it. It works real well. But then, you know, like on those steps, that step, that, that steps actually went into yeah. the grooming tub and got drenched. It got sprayed heavy, left set to set with the Odo band, and then a nozzle wet, wet, wet. I mean, it's really, really washed. I don't know where, I don't know where Baju's place would have been. I know where she sleeps in the morning. It's on top of one of the um, cat furnitures in the office, and when she's really laid out flat, you can't see her from looking down on the from the floor. Yeah, we, we ought to measure Jacob's tail again. Again? Uh, it's been over a week, yeah. <laughs> this is Jenny, and this is Rory. Yep, yeah, on top of the desk is a good place. Yeah, that was pretty funny. Jackie S. was indeed laughing at herself. Yeah. You know, today Snoozles, or Snuzzles, Snuzzles was laying with, um, with Rory in, in a volunteer's arms. Hi, baby. <laughs> yes, that's what I thought. It is on your. A lot of times, if the phone rings during boxes, I always think it's one of you guys, which it is. Yeah, well, the table here right in front of the cam has like four rugs piled up on it. Um, we're Now, tomorrow, oh my goodness, I haven't counted all the cards for my mom, but I thank all of you for sending the cards. My mom is going to have so much fun with that. Um, just uh, while I'm remembering it, too, <laughs> is... Um, is uh, da, 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 da. tomorrow I've got to go pick up my sister Patty, the one that lives in Idaho. At her plane comes in at 3:45, and um, and uh, then we're coming straight home here and going to meet my family in here in Defiance. So we're going to take my mom out to a restaurant to eat supper tomorrow. So I am not going to be able to. Um, do boxes tomorrow night so if you guys can just give everybody the heads up tomorrow because of my mom's birthday supper I, I won't be here during box time can you show us the thing you read with your cam okay critter cat I'm not sure what you mean can you show us the thing you read with your cam let me know what you mean there please the bribe collection Uh, Rory was actually out this morning a little bit. I shut the office door and let him out there. And uh, he did he did pretty good. 
Jackie doesn't have a birthday this year. <laughs> okay, and I'm sorry, I'm so far behind here. Can you put the cam on the screen you read? The cam is on the same screen. I've got my screen is kind of big. The cam's on the left side, the chat's on the right side. Yeah, he loves to roll. That Rory does. Rory, we put him down at uh, somewhere between 8 and 10 months old. <laughs> Sarah, you behave now. No telling secrets. Well, he's a uh, reverence life. We, he's actually like, um, it's a American short hair. But pe some people do call them the macro tabbies. He weighs, what did he weigh today? Eight pounds something, I believe. We did weigh him. Yeah, they have that bullseye on the side. He's he's still in his um, pen, but we've been opening his cage door. And today when he was out, he got a little frightened and he went back in his pen, which is what we want them to do. Angel Kisses is doing better. Her um, right leg is uh, doing is getting better her left leg is uh, very little weight bearing and it still kind of folds over a little bit Judy S wasn't in this morning but uh, Jackie Jackie S got fooled with her my sister Patty yes my mom knows that my sister's coming and the reason that my sister Patty is coming is that uh, she's got a really important job interview for at uh, the Parkview Hospital in Indiana. They're flying her in for a, a interview, so I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Wouldn't that be awesome? She's been out west for many, many, many years. And, oh, my goodness, it would be awesome if she was back in this area only an hour away. Uh, Leggy, then, is your box supposed to come tomorrow, Leggy? If it is, I, I'll have to write me a note on that. <laughs> Bandit saw himself. That's cool, PJ. I think mom's going to have a really fun day tomorrow. We had uh, ice cream cake for her yesterday. My mm -hmm. niece from Columbus came up today to take and took her to lunch, and she went. Uh, no, there was someone that came in today just to have us put the flea prevention on. Is <laughs> birthday is the worst kept secret? No, it is a secret. We don't yeah. know. <laughs> Yeah, it's a lot of people will call that a macro. I think he's going. I think Rory is going to be a big boy. He loves his belly rub. He does. Isn't that wonderful? Um, BLH. I don't really ever count. I really don't count. Um, one time someone counted and we were like in the one twenties, one thirties, and I had a heart attack. All I know is we gotta. Got to keep working on every adoption. Uh, no, no, Skeetikins on, I am assuming you're talking about um, angel kisses. And it's, it's, uh, it's going to get better. She has to start using the muscles in there. I think voting for Pat, for uh, Sheriff Putter says is still on the website. So, <clears throat> if you haven't voted, get your votes in. Okay, thanks, Bubbles, for tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> Night, MF. What happened? What, what does he have? He's laying on his back with I his, see. his back legs. Does he, I see her way up. Does he have a banana? Yeah. Aw, <laughs> Rory's being a silly boy. Okay, hey, Jenny, would you get in that, the big red cabinet on the right side?
here on the bottom right, there's those big white cards. Will you write uh, envelope from Leggy Girl, Leggy Gal? Open. Oh, wait, Leggy, I, if you have your return address, I might need your first name so that I know what to look for. Open on Wednesday or Thursday. Open on Thursday. Then I'll take that out. Leggy what? Leggy Gal. Sure. Okay, Java, I got it now. Oh, wasn't that so sad, Shorty? I just read that. Oh, boy. And DLH, normally, yes, like what Daystar said, normally we work at 80 to 110 at any given time. We have March and April to get our numbers down as low as what we can possibly get them so that we're ready for um, baby season. But also we have um, six, some porch kitties, 16 cats cove slash kitty city kitties, and a whole mess of them out on the farm ground, but they're all spayed. Okay, I'm trying to get this hurried up here. My mom's name is Eldora. Hi, Splash. Thank you, Mud. Okay. Leggy, gal, if you're on, though, if you did put a return address, you need to let me know what your first name is, unless you did put Leggy, gal, on the return, so that way I'll know which one, um, which envelope is yours? And Jenny, do you know where Jason is? I can't. No. Okay. Give a holler. Jason. Oh, here he is. Come on, buddy. Hey, Jenny, you want to hold him for me? Okay, we gotta mark our spot. It's right there. Well, you're such a good sitter stiller. Whoa! Oh. It's shrunk. No, <laughs> kidding. He is up. His it is up to. It is now 12 inches. Oh my gosh. It grew an inch and a half in a week. No, no, no. It was 11, then it was 11 and a half. Now we're 12. It definitely touches the 12. Oh my gosh. And actually, I'm down a little bit. So we're going to call it 12. Holy moly. He's part monkey. <laughs> oh. Do you remember Golden Yeah. How long was that? Do you remember? That was one of the first years. I was thinking that was a 12. Yeah. Well, they had, when we still lived on Peter, we were built in the house, so it's been over 10. Jeez. Yeah, they adopted that cat long time ago. Yeah. I don't remember its name. Yeah. I haven't seen, I haven't heard from them for a long time. 